Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another video. In this video, we're gonna be doing something short and sweet, and we're gonna be upgrading to the latest and greatest in Kali Linux. So if you guys are ready for the video, please like, subscribe, and share, and let's get into the video and have some fun. All right, folks, so here we are on my local Kali Linux machine. So the first thing I always do, what you should do as well, is see what version of Kali Linux you're currently running. So we can do that with cat etc slash OS release. And this will give us the current version of Kali Linux that we're running, right? So in my case, I'm running not too old, 2024.1. If we go out, let's just go out to Kali really quick. And you'll see the latest and greatest is 2024.2 that it just came out. So if we hit get Kali Linux here and you come all the way down and you can see right here, whoops, too far, Kali Linux right here. So 2022.4 is the latest and greatest release. So how can we get there without installing the whole operating system again? You're in the right spot. So let's do that because tonight is Friday night and I figured I'll do this video tonight because I need to upgrade to the latest and greatest so we can do it together. All right, so the first thing I always do is let's do, I'm already inside of sudo, but if you're running from, let's just do it like you guys. Let's just go to exit the proper way, the way we should all do it, but I like to run everything as root because I'm lazy. But we can do sudo apt update, right? So when we do that, we have to put our fancy pantsy password. So let me do that. So now this is gonna go ahead and update everything before we actually do the full upgrade. So this might take a few minutes. Let's see how fast my internet is my internet is tonight and we'll see how long this takes. So we'll give this a couple moments. So what we should be expecting from the actual upgrade, this is actually done. We'll see what's going on in that in a second. So if you come out to Kali.org, the blog, you can see down here, there's quite a few new tools right here, the new tools in the Kali, Auto Recon, and so many more, and you can do that yourself and you can check that out. So I like this, this is a search for CVE info. So let's, uh, let's go ahead and see what else is popping. So the next one I wanna do is I wanna do sudo apt, of, I wanna do a full upgrade, right? So full upgrade dash y, okay? So we'll let this cook. This might take some time. This is gonna go mental and go crazy, and do its thing. This is giving me like, making me dizzy, so I wanna go here. So once this is actually complete, we can go run that same command to see if our distro was fully upgraded to the latest and greatest, which is 2024.2. So let's take a break, resume once this is done, and we'll see where we're at. All right, folks, so that took, I don't know, 15 minutes or so. So now that has been all completed. So the next thing which we can do is we can just do a control L here. And what I would like to show you guys, if you guys don't have, if you get any errors, I wanted to show this before ETC, I'm the worst typer, and then APT and then we can do the res the source, right? So the source list will show us the sources of our uploads, excuse me, our apps and all that stuff. So what you can do is just make sure you have this in here. If this is not here, obviously, you can go to Google or you can just go to their Kali machine or Kali website, sorry, it's getting late, and, uh, and get it. And just all you have to do is instead of Instead of cat, we can just do, for an example, nano, and then you can just add it in here, all right? So that's pretty much that. So now, since it's all updated, now it's the moment of truth. It only takes about 15 minutes to do a full upgrade. So now let's go ahead and cat the OS release and see if it's dot two. Here we go. So we are version 2024.2 so we went from 2021 uh, 2024.1 to 2024.2 so now going back to our our tools and everything like that these are all the new tools and if you want to update completely with all the you know i might do this i might not i'm just still thinking about it for tonight but 
I just had it up. So what we can do also, we can do a full upgrade. So let me just copy this command. I just copied it here. So I'm just gonna do it. So after this is all done, what you can do is do sudo, whoa, not that. That was, that was something else I was doing. All right, let me try that again. Let me just copy this code and then just paste it here. I don't know why this is doing this. All right, forget it. What I wanna do is try this now. Why is it copying this? This is weird. All right, what I'll just do, I'll just do it, uh, I'll just type it out. So you do sudo apt install Kali Linux, Kali Linux all dash y. Let me just, so that's the command right there. And let me put my fancy password. This is optional, right? So you can do this. Obviously I got an error. I would probably have to locate it. Maybe this is the old command. I would have to see what's up, but you don't have to do that, right? That, you know, that's just a bonus. It, it bombed out. This is pretty much, uh, you know, an add on command. Don't even worry about that. But now since we have the latest and greatest Let's go ahead and check it out. Let me just do this. Um, sudo su. All right, and now let's do like net exec. And now we can now we can just install this. Yeah, it's fine. And now we should be good once this is installed. We'll give this a moment. This will be just something quick and easy that I can just install really quick, so you guys can see. Then we can just pull that down now and it should be golden in about, I don't know, a couple seconds, hopefully. Uh, come on, you could do it. Yep, that's fine. Yep, that's fine. Okay, so now let's try that again. And now it should be there. Now we, here we go. We got NetExec installed. Bada bing, bada boom. So this is definitely a, this replaces crack map exec. I just did that really quick because it's something quick and easy. But that really concludes this video of, of upgrading from whatever version you are on to the latest and greatest of 2024.2. So hopefully this was informative. If you have any questions, put it in the comments below. Thank you so much, and I'll see you in the next one.